What's up everybody, Y Davis here, back with another review. So I'm showing you guys a Fair God Collection, Fall 2022, Part 2. Now before I get into the video, I just want to say thank you guys for all the support. Keep on liking, keep on subscribing, and it really motivates me to keep going when I see you guys liking my content. Also, let us you know I'm in the right direction of showing you guys you want to see. If you're new to the channel, I just want to say thank you and welcome. I drop a lot of dope content here, so consider subscribing. Also, there's a 4K video playing in the background of me. And you guys, when this video is coming ahead of time, you follow me on Instagram at Y Davis. But let's get right into it, guys. So today, this did drop at PacSun. Now, once again, we don't get all the pieces at PacSun. It's not even in the one in New York Soho. So, um, I don't know you know how they're outsourcing these pieces but the only place to get all the pieces is online now before i mean like a year or two ago if you guys watched the reviews on all my old like old old fear guard reviews i was able to get like everything from the drop maybe just like a few pieces that i just didn't want on my own but um recently we haven't been getting all the pieces i don't know why um you know you could probably get like a relaxed sweatpants and maybe like a regular sweatpants on some of the drops but i was only able to get 11 pieces on here now show you guys the receipt <clears throat> as you guys can see i got a discount on the pieces so now i guess because there's no resale on it and stuff is starting to sit you can actually use your points on clothing so as you guys see on my receipt you see i get i got a little bit of a discount on all the pieces as you guys see because i was able to use my points so this is something new that they're doing i don't know how long that's gonna last and just gave me the discount but anyway um like i said i got 11 pieces and today i'll be showing you guys the wood uh off-white and canary but you know it's just a second the same regular uh plastic that we get and it's an essential fair guide on here once again they did go up on these prices five bucks for basically all the pieces see you guys what these pieces look like right now okay guys now this is the wood pants as you guys can see and a size small now i'm about 5'9 to 5'10 160 pounds currently um and we did get a five dollar increase on these as well once again they are 95 bucks now this color does look like a similar color that we've seen earlier but you know this is the wood colorway. Now, this is what it looks like on me. As you guys see, I still have a lot of space in these pants, especially like a lot of scrunchery towards the bottom. And you know, they have a lot of space in here. So if you are true to size medium and sweatpants, like I normally am, I still went down to the size small so I can have more of a tailored slash, you know, fitted look. Now, if you get a medium, they will still fit, but after you wear them, the clothes will get a little bit looser. They won't have that same tightness and structure to them. So I would consider going down a size in my opinion now you can go through the size if you have a little bit more of a stomach or you know or a little bit wider in the leg area but in my opinion the small fits perfectly so normally i like to go down a size because i feel like the clothes look a bit a lot better in my opinion also towards the back here i don't have a big back side but as you guys see the pants fit me more in the butt area okay so in my opinion small is the way to go you can go through the size but the waist here will be, you know, hanging off you a little bit. And as you wear the clothes, they will loosen up a little bit more. And the only way to get them back to regular is by taking it to the cleaners. I wouldn't suggest you guys regular washing these clothes because it will lose, you know, the value in them, in my opinion. But this is what it looks like. I'm going to throw on a t-shirt for you guys right now. Okay, guys. Now, this is what the wood t-shirt looks like in a size small. Once again, I'm about 160 pounds, 5'9 and 5'10". And as you guys can see, it fits me pretty well. If you want a little bit of a tighter fit and you're about the same measurements as me, go to the extra small, even though they probably might not have that in store, so you might have to get it online. But as you guys can see, it does wrap my arms pretty nicely. Um, I still do have a little bit of space right here, but it's not like flapping in the wind, as you guys can see right there. So I do have a little bit of space in this shirt, but uh, it fits me pretty nice in my opinion. Once again, I'm about 5'9 to 5'10, 160 pounds, and this is what the shirt looks like in a size small. We still, the, we still get the essentials right here going across the left chest. All right, I'm gonna turn it around for you guys and show you guys this real quick as well. All right, once again, this shirt was 45 bucks. So we do get a $5 increase on this shirt as well. All right, but this is what it looks like with the sweatpants. And I'm gonna show you guys what the crew neck looks like right now, but I'm gonna show you guys one more time. All right, even if you are a little bit bigger than me, um, I would suggest you guys to probably go down one size so it could feel like it's a regular fitting shirt in my opinion all right i'm gonna show you guys a crew neck right now uh, so this is the relaxed crew neck and the wood colorway now the only thing negative that i would say about this crew neck is that it is kind of hard to put your head through the top right here and as you guys can see um it's really tight around the neck area in my opinion i don't know if you guys can tell but i definitely do feel the tightness around my neck area i wish this was the regular one but they didn't have the regular one there in stock but you know 
again it is what it is all right now i'll show you guys the bottom right here as you guys see how open it is i mean this is one not really my favorite but you know i just want to pick it up to show you guys what it looks like um but this is how it is this is a size small once again about 160 5 9 to 5 10 all right I'll show you guys this real quick once again this is the relaxed crew neck this is not the regular one as you guys see how open it is at the bottom in my opinion i would have went with the regular one but you know we only had the relaxed one in stock so again you know we didn't have i didn't have an option so you know this is what it looks like though pretty nice this is a size small so normally i am a medium but i went down and had that more tailored slash you know fitting look so just want to show you guys this now i'm gonna show you guys what the hoodie looks like right now this is what the hoodie with the sweatpants look like and the shirt under it so as you guys can see the shirt hangs out of it like an extender tee um pretty nice in my opinion this is a size small everything that you see on me right now is actually in a size small so this is the fit right here as you guys see i have a lot of scrunchie here um i will say though when you lift up your arm it does come back a little bit so that's the only issue that you might have especially if you are a little bit taller than me so um in my opinion in that case you might need to get the medium because you don't want the hoodie to be shrinking at the arms because that just means it's too small but as you guys see this one fits me perfectly um i am about 5'10 5'9 to 5'10 160 pounds once again we get the essential scare guy going across the chest but this is what it looks like pretty clean in my opinion let me know what you guys think about this the whole set right here turn around for you guys but you guys see it with the extender t i'm gonna tuck it in though and show you guys what it looks like as well throw a hood on for you guys too okay to show you guys what that looks like really quickly all right pretty clean okay i'm gonna tuck the shirt in for you guys to show you what it looks like if you didn't actually have the t on just in case you guys want to go for that look so this is what it looks like all right you guys think about this colorway let me know in the comments box below are you guys going for this drop are you guys tired of fear god let me know what you guys think i still like it i still dig it um but you know a lot of people are probably tired of it by now but you know it is what it is all right now i'm gonna show you guys the next colorway okay guys so in my opinion the best color from the drop the off black this is what the sweatpants look like now once again this is not the regular sweatpants as you guys can see at the bottom they had that relaxed look which I'm not really feeling, you know what I mean? I did want the regular sweatpants in this colorway, but of course the store did not carry it. So um, this is what they look like right here. All right, show you guys, this is size small. All right, now I do have a lot of space right here. It does have a lot of leg room at the bottom as well. So if you guys are interested in getting this relaxed sweatpants look, this is what they look like in a size small. Now, normally a size medium and regular sweatpants, but for all fear God extensions, I try to go down to the small because it has more of a fitted, tailored look to it with a little bit of bagginess, if you guys know what I mean. But this is what it looks like right here. I'll show you guys the side. These are 95 as well, I believe. Yeah. Yep, 95. So I'll show you guys from the side right here. I'll show you guys from the back. As you guys see, they fit me well back here. If I would've went with the medium, it would've been a lot bigger towards the back and around the waist here, it wouldn't be as fitted. It would have a little bit more space and eventually they would start hanging off. And I would have to tie this drawstring a lot tighter because of how loose it is in the uh, waist area. But uh, this is what they look like. I'm gonna show you guys the shirt right now. Okay guys, now this is what the shirt looks like in the off black, as you guys see, pretty nice fit. This is a size small. Once again, I'm about 5'9 to 5'10, 160 pounds. Normally I wear a medium in shirts, but in this shirt, I do I did go with the small. As you guys see how it fits me and goes around my arms. Now if you want something a little bit tighter, try to go down two sizes. Um, but you know in store you probably won't be able to find the extra small So um, this is what the shirt looks like on me pretty nice in my opinion. I like the way it hugs my arms You know Pretty cool. What you guys think? It says essential right here going across the left part of the chest But I'll show you turn around for you guys and show you Okay This is what it looks like. What do you guys think about this colorway? What's your favorite color from the drop? Let me know in the comments box below But uh, this is what this looks like. I'm gonna show you guys the crew neck right now. As you guys can see, this is a regular crew neck and it doesn't have that relaxed look at the bottom. See how much tighter this is around my waist right here. And I have the shirt peeking from under it as well. Now, this is the crew neck that I wish the other one came in, but it had that relaxed look to it. But as you guys can see, this looks fire. Now I'm just missing the sweatpants. So, you know, it is what it is once again, but this is what it looks like. As you guys can tell, I'm not that happy right now, but uh, you know, this is the fit. I love the fit of this one. Uh, it's a lot more easy to put your head through as well. If you guys 
missed that part in the video i did say that the other one to put your head through it was kind of tight this one is regular it just goes through easily in my opinion but this is what it looks like right here this is a size small normally i am a size medium but i feel like if you want a more tailored look or you know a more fitted look go down a size from your normal size in my opinion all right but this is what it looks like i'm also going to tuck this in really quickly so you guys can see what it looks like if you didn't have a shirt under it okay uh the crew neck for this one was 90. all right so the price on this one was 90 90 bucks all right but this is what it looks like if you had no shirt under it pretty clean what do you guys think let me know in the comments box below i just wish i had the regular sweatpants to this one i'm not really feeling the relaxed sweatpants you know what i mean but it is what it is once again but i just want to show you guys what this look like i'm gonna show you guys the hoodie right now as you guys can see this set came with the relaxed look i don't know why this one didn't come with the relaxed crew neck it came with the regular crew neck but i don't know how how the shipping works over there whatever the case may be but it doesn't make sense to me but this is what it looks like right here pretty clean in my opinion i mean i just rather have that other look you know what i'm saying it's just what i prefer but um this is what it looks like this is a size small once again it was kind of hard to put my head through this top right here so i'm guessing all the relaxed pieces are going to be hard to put your head through at the top maybe i just got a big head let me know what you guys think about that in the comments box below when you guys do get your pieces on the relaxed tops but um this is what it looks like right here show you guys from the side as well but as you guys can see this is the relaxed look from top to toe okay so just want to show you guys this really quickly also put a hood on it for you guys so you guys can see okay how much is this hoodie? This hoodie was 95 bucks. All right, show you guys the back the side, the front. All right, now I'm gonna show you guys the last color. Okay guys, now this is the Canary sweatpants. As you guys see, they come in a regular sweatpants. This is not the relaxed. And I do really like this colorway. Now, as you guys can see, this is a size medium. I'm gonna put a video right here and show you guys a size small from this drop to show you guys a little bit of the differences that I do see. Once again, you will see that these are a lot more baggier towards the bottom and have a lot of space in the legs right here. But when I turn to the side, as you guys can see as well, and towards the back here, this does not fit my butt the way the other pants do. And like I was telling you guys earlier that these will eventually loosen up as you guys start wearing them. And the way to get them back to that regular feeling and the way they felt was to take them to the cleaners and wash them. Do not wash these regularly. As you guys see in the back area right here, it's not as tight. All right, turn to the side for you guys. Let you guys see what it looks like. I really do like this colorway. Um, this colorway is really bright and it will turn a lot of heads. It's a very nice colorway if you guys are interested in getting this one. I, I consider you guys to get this one. Um, as you guys see around the waist here as well, it is very stretchy right here. So, you know, the medium will fit if you're about my size. Once again, I'm about 5'9 to 5'10, 160 pounds. But as you start to wear it, this will start to loosen up and you won't have that same structure as you have when you first purchase these items. I'm just letting you guys know that right now. It may look good on me right now, but as time goes on, this will loosen up a lot. I'm telling you guys right now, but this is what it looks like if you guys are interested in getting the medium sweatpants okay guys and as you guys can see this is the canary shirt pretty dope in my opinion size small it really does fit me around the arm area once again go down a size if you want this type of look if you want it to hug your arms a little bit but not too much but if you want more of that muscle shirt look to it try to go down two sizes in my opinion when you guys get this shirt and you don't get the right size i don't want to hear you in the comments box man i messed up on the sizing so make sure you guys watch this video if you haven't purchased it yet or, you know, just make sure you guys watch the whole video because I am showing you guys what certain shirts look like. You can also check out my other Fair God videos for better insights of like extra small, small, and medium. So uh, this is what the shirt looks like. Once again, in a size small, pretty dope. I, I, once again, I really do like this colorway. Show you guys from the side right here. Really nice shirt. Okay, this shirt is 45. If I didn't mention it already, these pants was 95. Get that five dollar increase again on all of these items but this is what the fit looks like pretty clean in my opinion i'm gonna show you guys the hoodie and the last piece right now okay guys now this is the last piece from the drop the hoodie as you guys see this hoodie is the regular standard hoodie this is not the relaxed one and this thing just looks fire in my opinion this is probably the best colorway from the drop now that i have it on from head to toe part two from the drop anyway but uh this is what it looks like as you guys can see right here uh, this is the regular hoodie it's not the relaxed one and this is what it looks like on me in a size small it still fits me right here so it has a little bit of bagginess 
as you guys can see pretty dope colorway what do you guys think is the best colorway from this part two drop i really do like this colorway and i'm glad it didn't come with that relaxed hoodie <laughs> but uh this is pretty dope right here all right once again this is a size small in the hoodie and this hoodie top was kind of hard to put on my head i don't know if they like changed the sizing around the neck area but this one was kind of hard to put on my head as well let me know if you guys had that same experience but um show you guys the side right here pretty dope you guys think about this colorway this is probably the best one in my opinion uh i really do like this colorway a lot something different something i don't have so you know i will be wearing this one a lot in the upcoming season so especially with that fall weather but uh yeah man this is what the drop looks like hope you guys liked it make sure you guys like comment subscribe show your boy some love and stay tuned